It's night two in the West Midlands. Cheers, everybody. Where Ange and fiancé Dave are putting on a swanky soiree in the hope of bagging the grand. In the kitchen, Ange is slicing ciabatta for the starter. Oh, I'm a bit thick. Plate. Well, they're just like you, aren't they? Thick. Now, now, you two. Meanwhile, Cleo and Nick are seeing stars. Sort of. Oh, wow. I like to get dressed up and go out a lot. Yeah. I don't seem to know who anyone is on here, though. They all look like they're from somewhere. She looks like... Is that Holly? Holly Willoughby or something? Sorry, Holly, if you're watching. He looks like the guy from the um, dancing show. We we'll have to ask them, definitely have to ask them who these people are and what these pictures are about. Back with the hosts and David's firmly in the driving seat. Would you like to go and get the plates? Yes. It's a, it's a good job that I'm here because Andrew would have been lost. Nice to know everything's under control. Okay. Something burning. Oh, oh God. She's took the thing. That's it, they've had it. They were burning. We know. Why wasn't you watching them? Excuse me. The slightly singed bread is adorned with prawns and a dainty sprinkling of herbs. Putting these little bits on just to make it look a bit more glamorous. It's not worked. Chili King Prawn Bruschetta. How posh. Oh, thank you. Well, this is our starter. Get stuck in and let us know what you think of it. Thank you. Okay, thank you. Thank, thank you. you. I love chili prawns, especially with light. I love bruschetta. The whole thing, perfect, lovey. It was just like going to a friend's house for a meal. It yeah. wasn't. A, a, a friend that just learned to cook. Did you bake the bread yourself? I didn't make the bread. Okay. I bought the bread. Okay. Is that why you've had time to bling up the table? Because you've kept your food very plain and simple and bought your bread. The funny thing is, when you say plain and simple, if you knew what went into the sauce of making that. Yeah, but we made our own and bread then, yeah, and sauce. Of course. But you didn't make your own pastry. pastry. Are you making your own pastry or anything to go with we're the rest not, of your we're food? We're not having pastry. No, it's like you bought the bread, yeah? That's Absolutely. fine, it's Absolutely. very nice bread, Absolutely. very nice no, bread. Well, well, we think so, we think it's yeah, nice. Yeah, it's lovely bread. I was getting my own back, it's only what she did to me. And it was just a bit of fun. She was a little bit bitchy there, and there was no need for that, to be honest. I, I think the bread mm. that you made at your house, I couldn't eat it, to be honest. Yeah, but we put the effort in, we didn't just buy it, we tried. But we've put but a lot of effort into doing... I can tell. I know, cos it takes a lot of effort to toast bruschetta and pop some prawns on, you know. It's very tasty, very tasty. It's so classy you do it. toast is lovely. You've done it very classily. The lime was a lovely touch. What did, how did you make the sauce? Uh, there's actually sweet, a sweet chilli sauce in there. OK. So did you buy the sweet chilli sauce? Uh, yeah, we bought the chilli sauce. You bought it. OK. Were the prawns cooked from raw? No, they were shot bought, but they were do trimmed and yeah, prepared by very neat and beautiful. A marinade. Yeah. Oh, Dave. <laughs> Please say something, anyone. Well, this is a quiet we've been on week. Well, yeah. <laughs> The silence was a bit awkward, but I did think she did deserve it. I think Sam could have handled it differently. <laughs> he, he really came guns blazing, ready to shoot. Gung ho, wow. She did. <laughs> well, I knew the guests tonight was going to have a dig, but at the end of the day, they did clear the plates. The points are going up and up and up.